Hey everybody, Shane, Diesel Wrench 4 coming at you. Don't know if I'm going to be coming at you on YouTube or Vimeo. Be the same user, either way. Um, uh, as you guys have probably already known watching other videos, a lot of us that were at YouTube are still at YouTube, but we ventured over to the side of Vimeo. Um, I looked around a little bit. Uh, as far as the uh, mobile app, eh, to me it leaves a little bit to, to be desired, um, but then again I haven't used it much. Uh, basically going on my phone using the desktop version and that's how I found other users and followed them and whatnot. Uh, so, yeah, just a little short video, see how everybody's doing. Uh, you know, having a pipe, thought why not. Mm, haven't done a video since the other day. Um, I did one with uh, Aaron, the man with the plan, Harlow. My ver my side didn't come out. Um, if you watched it, as you can see that we were boxing back and forth through the video. We had all kinds of technical difficulties. Either he'd lose service or mine would be spotty. And But uh, I recorded it on my old tablet that my daughter plays with. It wouldn't pick up audio, so I had to use uh, my, head, my earplugs from my phone that have a microphone on them. And... Sometimes you can hear me, sometimes you can hear Aaron, sometimes you can't hear either one of us. So, I uploaded it, I opted not to publish it, um, because it was just 38 minutes of, of waste. Um, you guys make sure you go over and, and watch Aaron's video, it's pretty comical watching watching him. Um, housekeeping, I am, uh, this is another reason I decided to post this video while I was smoking. This is my Major Black, that as some of you know I got off of eBay. Um, like a month ago um, this is only third or fourth time I've smoked it um, and in it I have some McBaron old dark fired I believe that's what it's called um, the flake from uh, Aaron the man with playing Harlow um, and to try something else cause I've been packing my pipes way too tight lately and I've watched some videos and Aaron told me you don't get out and watch Cal's videos so I did, and I watched Kel's video on uh, flake, cutting it up into uh, one eighth, one eighth inch squares, and then just filling your pipe. And that's what I did, and it's smoking great. Um, it's offered to bite me a little bit, and as you guys know from watching my other videos, I get my tongue gets the bit no, <clears throat> wicked. <coughs> Excuse me. So, uh, but it's not bad. It's the pipe's smoking cool. It's it's not it's not bad. It's Sorry about shaking the phone. I keep forgetting. Normally, I got my phone on a stand. I'm holding it today. I apologize. Uh, it's probably shaky as hell. You guys can probably hear the wind. And my pipe went out. I'll be right back. Hey, guys. Sorry about that. I got run in my mouth there. And I uh, neglected to take good care of my pipe and keep it going. Give her a little tamp and a little bit of flame. But uh, anyway, so I'm in the air about this pipe. Um, the tobacco. It's the first time I ever smoked it. It's not bad. Um, this pipe, when I bought it, um, the guy that posted it, um, you know, he posted it. it, it was the, the whole, I bought two pipes from him. It was just a bad experience with that guy. You know, and he posted it, you know, I don't believe it's the, the original stem. It's obviously not the original stem. Um, what he neglected to tell me was that uh, the stem basically falls out of the pipe. Um, I watched a few videos of different things to try. Uh, I tried a few of them. Uh, nothing outside of smoking it has really helped it. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I've been trying to smoke it more, and it seemed to get a little better. Uh, and I'm going to lose it from running my mouth. Sorry about that. Twice in one video. <laughs> So anyway, um, smoking it, it's it's seeming to fit better. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm very sorry. But I still don't really care for the stem. Um, let's see if you can... It's real narrow. Um, that drop right there bothers me. Um, the pipe I like. Um, in his pictures, I'm trying to get so you guys can pick this up. You see those marks? Very sorry about that. I had to pause and cough my brains out. But, uh... There's some, some wounds on this. I hope this is picking it up. Um, that you can kind of see. I don't know if they're from 
when it was made, but they've been filled, it looks like, and don't quite match. Um, and I don't know if those are... I'm going to give up on it. I don't know if those are defects in the briar when he was making the pipe, or if somebody's fixed it afterwards. They don't get any hotter than the rest of the pipe. They're not cooler than the rest of the pipe. I happen to like the look of it, the little bat of wounds. Um, some people probably wouldn't. Um, I fell in love with this pipe when I saw it on his listing. I had to have it. I did not pay a lot of money for it. I think I paid $6 and then $4 shipping, so for 10 bucks. But, uh, man, I've been really thinking about finding it a new home. I don't, I'm kind of in the air. But it's one of those things, I don't want to pass my headache onto somebody else. Um, but there's people, like, uh, I've been told, you take it into a tobacconist, you know, into your local pipe shop. And a lot of times they'll fix your stems and stuff like that. Um, I haven't had the chance to do that. As you guys know, I haven't made it yet, but I finally found one. So, um, I'm thinking about throwing out an offer if somebody's interested in it. Um, somebody would like to have it. Um, knowing that the stem doesn't fit the best. It's getting better. Just smoking it, you know, the few times that I have. Uh, when I first got it, it would, like I said, it would basically almost fall out. Um... But, I don't know, shoot me a, shoot me a message, uh, PM, and we'll see if we can work something out. You know, again, I'm not trying to sell it, um, but, and I'm not sure. You might send me a message, I might say, hey, I changed my mind, or I might say, hey, give me your address, or I might say, I don't know, who knows, but maybe nobody is even interested in that. I mean, it's like the ugly duckling. Sorry to move the camera again, but, uh, so I don't know, I just thought I'd throw that, kind of throw that out there. Oh, it's, it's ugly outside today. Rain off and on. Cold. Low 40s. And of course, outside of the sweatshirt, I have shorts on, on the porch, because that's how I roll. But, uh, again, uh, just want to see how everybody's doing. And it's also a little uh, update contest of mine ends in four days, the 14th. Um, haven't had any entries in a while. Apparently people have lost interest, but hey, I get it. Such is life, we all have things to do. So, um, Without further ado, if I can keep my thumb from blocking the camera, I'd like to tell y'all, have a great day. Enjoy. It's the Diesel Wrench 4, signing out. Y'all keep them wrenches turning and the pipe tobacco burning.